Today we're taking a look at our ND throttle adapters for Hasselblad X-Series cameras. Let's adapt this vintage Nikon pancake lens to this Hasselblad 907X and 50C with our ND throttle adapter. Just mount the lens on the adapter and the adapter on the camera. The ND throttle is more than just an adapter. It also has a built-in variable ND filter. Turn the ring to adjust between two to eight stops of ND filtration. A VND filter like this is essential for shooting long exposures and shallow depth of field video. Here's an example of where the ND throttle's VND filter shines. I have the Hasselblad 50C digital back set on video mode, the ISO set to 100, and the shutter speed set to 1 48th of a second. With the lens wide open at f1.8, we are way overexposed, but as I crank in the variable ND, it cuts the amount of light hitting the sensor and gets us to a usable exposure. The variable ND filter in the ND throttle is also helpful for shooting shallow depth of field photos like these. One quick note, the Hasselblad 907X and 50C digital back normally use the leaf shutter in Hasselblad's X-Series lenses, so when you're adapting a non-native lens, you have to use the 50C's digital shutter. This digital shutter works fine with a tripod or when shooting at a fast shutter speed, but hand-holding the camera and using slower shutter speeds can create some pretty bad rolling shutter distortion. Here are some examples. This first shot of a bridge railing, I was hand-holding the camera. I think I had the shutter speed set at 1 60th. You can see the weird wave distortion on the bars in the bridge. I got similar rolling shutter distortion on this fence post in the first shot, while in the second shot I sped up the shutter speed a lot and I was able to get rid of it. So basically, if you're using one of our adapters with this camera, make sure to use a tripod or fast shutter speeds. Photodeox currently offers six ND throttle adapters for Hasselblad X-Series cameras. Click the link in the description to learn more about these ND throttle adapters. Comment below if you have any questions and click here to subscribe to our YouTube channel.